I grew up in Colorado, so my dad would always take me to these mountains that were like covered in crystals or these amethyst mines and things like that. And but then I guess when I went to school, like I kind of dropped all that in a way. You know, I moved to a city, and it's just like, maybe, and, and then I went to school. It's like I spent the rest, you know, 15 years in a in a white, you know, gallery spare studio. You know, and I kind of forgot about all that. So maybe it's a way of like trying to bring that back into my life. Maybe a lot of my influences initially were just my own idea of figure, my own idea of flower. You know, kind of filtered through historical things that I was looking at, and not really paying attention to specific references like a certain you know succulents that actually existed or something. But more and more, I've been interested in looking at nature instead of it just being an internal dialogue. I think the other thing about landscape that was a basis for my work was that it seemed like just a you know platform to begin from. It was this kind of neutral plane that anything could exist. And so like I guess uh, paring down my work like that always seemed to be a constant. You know, you imagine this blank space and take everything out of that space from your mind, you know, all the stuff, images that you're in your head, you know. You close your eyes, you know, or look into like a fog, you know, that's just white. <clears throat> and like, how do you reduce images and then slowly let things come back, you know, and like see what, 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 what's the first thing that comes back. And a lot of those earlier works, it was like the first thing that came into that plane, you know, I would make it. Any system to be a healthy system needs to be agitated, right, in a way. And I feel like maybe role of an artist, a role of an artist is to kind of agitate that system to kind of cause, cause people to rethink, rethink their space or just question expectations or question normalcy and things like that.